All right. Well, welcome, everybody. We're so glad you guys are here tonight. Uh, welcome, Todd. Welcome, Christy, Glenn, Tracy, so many of you guys. Liz, uh, we're so excited to have you guys on tonight. I am going to be sharing with you guys our, let's see, there's a few more people in the waiting room. Let's see. Let me just get these people in. All right, perfect. Um, Christina, can I make you co-host and you let people in? Would you mind? Oh, she doesn't have co-host as one of the options. That's weird. Hmm. Sorry, guys. Hold on. This is Beth's Zoom, not mine that we're using. Mine has a co-host option and hers does not. So that's interesting. So I'm going to admit a few more people. Hold on one second, guys. All right. So one thing people are going to learn is we, uh, we'll have to make sure people know to uh, join things on time. So I've got three people in the waiting room for Zoom, guys, and they have phone numbers. So if you guys have somebody that's waiting to get in, if you can let me know in the chat, otherwise I'm not going to accept is, is, them. Is 10714 number? Yes. You want me to admit yeah. it? Yeah, that's Teresa. Thank you. Um, and then I have a case underscore Martin at yahoo.com. Does anybody yeah, know who that's, that is? That's, yep, I do. Martin Case. Yep. That's Perfect. my guy. And then I have an iPhone too. And then I have an Amy. I'll accept Amy iPhone 2, I have no idea. Okay, perfect. All right, we're going to get started. And I'm just, listen, you guys, it's going to be a little bit of a squirrel because I'm going to have to look and see and admit people. And it's just a bummer. It's just the way it is. So, uh, but I want to get us started because those of you that are on time deserve to start on time. So I'm sorry we're starting five minutes late. I'm all about punctuality. If we say eight, we should be uh, beginning at eight. So welcome, everybody. My name is Blair Critch. I am one of your leaders here on Team Joy and part of LEMD, and we're so excited that you guys have joined this amazing company that's a telehealth concierge company that's focused on preventative health through longevity, sexual health, and weight management, and soon to come hormone replacement. So tonight, this is really for you as you are beginning your journey, and I see a lot of faces on here of people who've actually been with us now for a few weeks. Um, it's a refresher course, or it's for somebody who's brand new, a, just a very quick beginning 30-minute like, here's everything you're going to want to know, but it's not going to be everything that you need, I guarantee you, right? Um, and so we're going to hit record and we're going to get started. And also, I'm going to be sharing screen with you guys tonight. Here we go. All right. Perfect. Can you guys see that okay? Good. All right. Perfect. Great. Well, First of all, you made a great decision by joining uh, LEMD, and here's why. I have not seen any other business out there that is doing telehealth concierge with peptides in the platform that allows you to have affiliate marketing and build a team and make commissions off of them. Now, there's one big thing I always say is my dad is really big into stocks and he's always taught me that you're always looking for what the biggest next things are. My dad researches for two to three hours a day, Monday through Friday in his stocks. And one of the things that he has told me over this last year is AI, AI, AI. And then the last few months, I'd say since June, he had been bringing up peptides. Like, hey, what do you know about peptides? And I've been taking some, so I shared with him. And then he started bringing up um, the fact of telehealth and asked if I'd ever use telehealth, which I hope a lot of you guys have. I love it. I've actually used it even on Amazon. It's so amazing. And so when I was introduced to LEMD in August, and I heard it was a telehealth concierge company that focused on preventative health while using peptides, my brain went like ding, 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 ding. That's two out of the three things that my dad has been researching this last year while he is, you know, growing his stock portfolio. And so whenever you find something like this, you know that it's an amazing opportunity and you don't want to just ignore it, right? And so that's how I decided to jump in and look a little bit more at this business opportunity. So tonight we're going to be walking you guys through some getting started things that you're going to want to know. And one of the very very first things that you're going to want to know, and let me just move this so that I stop seeing that. Perfect. One of the very most important things that you're going to want to know is that you have two websites. So when you signed up with LEMD, you have your partner site. So it's partner.lemd.com. And when you go there, then you put in your login information. There's also a second site, and that's for customers. That's lemd.com slash whatever your username is. And that's what you're wanting to share with people. So make sure you have both of those saved into your phones. I'll call this a million-dollar idea, and you're going to hear me say this a lot tonight. Million-dollar ideas to me are when you can save yourself time to make more money. 
All right. And that to me is super important in my life because I have a busy life, as a lot of you guys do too. I work this alongside a real estate business, uh, having kids. Also, we have a, another uh, side business that we have. And so I'm busy. And I want to make sure that I do things that are the fastest and most profitable way possible. So when you're giving out people your lemd.com slash username, that's also where you can go and order your own product. So yes, you can be a customer of yourself and earn that 20 to 40% commission off your own sales. Also, you want to make sure that you take time to complete the training in your back office. So when you go to the partner.lemd, and let me show you guys. When you go to your LEMD site, you go under training, training portal. And as a first time user, you're going to say, I want to access my training for the first time. And then you're going to go through this training portal, which is full of so much amazing information. All right. And actually, once you go through the whole thing, you can earn a thousand points towards our, our very first getaway, which is going to be next September in Punta Cana at a five star resort that hasn't even opened yet. It's going to be brand new next fall. And we're going to be one of the very first teams and companies to ever be there. So that's really exciting. So step one, you want to make sure you clarify your goals. One of my favorite authors is Lisa Nichols, and she wrote a book called Abundance Now. And one of the things that she said in there is you cannot hit a moving target. Now, the reality is, can you hit a moving target? Maybe. But is it is it as likely as a target that you know exactly where you need to hit? No. And so that's why you want to make sure you have a goal. What is your goal? What do you want out of this business? Like take some time over the next few days and write it down. What do you want? What do you want to see happen in 30 days, 60 days, 90 days? What does that look like? What is it going to feel like when you achieve that? What are you going to do when you achieve that? What are you going to hear from your leaders and your family when you achieve the goal that you set out for yourself? How much money is going to be in your bank account? Get detailed with it and decide what do you want out of this? And here's the thing. If you don't even know what's possible yet, ask your leader who invited you to this, who you joined this business with, what's possible? Like, can I make 15000 a month? Yes. Can I make 1000 a month? Yes. Whatever you want out of this business, you can achieve, but you've got to know what you want. All right? Because that's what's going to help you on the days where you don't really feel like showing up because we all have days like that. You have to know what's moving you forward. That's why I really believe in vision boards. I don't believe in making pretty vision boards and putting them on your wall and never looking at them again. They are there so that I look every morning, every night, and I even have my, my vision statement written on mine that I read to myself every single morning. And then I also, on the days where I just don't feel like doing what I know I said I was going to do, right, then I look at it and I'm reminded of the things that I'm moving towards. So a really great goal for you to go ahead and start with the very first 30 days that you're in business is four customers getting started and four brand partners. This is an achievable goal for all of you, okay? This is something that anybody can do. Get four customers and four brand partners. And that might be the very first goal that you want to go to. And if you do that, you're going to actually move up in rank probably three ranks and be able to hit the very first bonus of $100, which we'll talk about at the very end today. Step two, build a list. If you've ever done anything like this before in our industry, and let me know in the chat feature, I'll come back and look at the chat in a second, but let me know in the chat, you know, is this a business that you've ever done before? Have you ever done anything in network marketing or direct sales before? And if the answer is no, then this is going to be new to you. But if the answer is yes, you've probably built a list before. And I always look at it like this. If I was going to open up a store tomorrow, an online boutique that also had a brick and mortar building to it down the street from me, who would be on my list? Who would I want to announce this new place to, right? That's what I start to think and start to have all these great ideas. So start thinking about people who love multiple opportunities. They understand in having multiple streams of income. Who do you know that's already a business owner? Who do you know that has health conscious? Who do you know in your own age group? Because most likely you're like me and you weren't feeling so great before you got on peptides. You were tired, exhausted, run down and stressed out. Who else do you know that's like that, right? And I always love the analogy, Frank. So F stands for friends, R stands for relatives, A stands for acquaintances. And I always say that can be um, like maybe old work friends or people that you used to know. Um, and can be neighbors, current neighbors, old neighbors. Even think about your neighbors you were growing up with, if you're still connected with them. K is for kids, friends. And just start thinking about who do you know that fits those, those categories? And don't um, decide for them. 
allow them to decide. You're reaching out to share this with them. When the person who reached out to me, Beth said, hey, listen, I know that we've already been talking about peptides. You've been on peptides. Did you know there's a company that you can share peptides with others and actually make a commission off of that? I was like, I had no idea. What if she hadn't reached out to me, right? Because I already had a very profitable business and I, she probably thought, well, she doesn't really need this. But thank goodness she did because it was an opportunity that I didn't even know I was looking for. And so that can happen quite often. So I always tell people, you want to get to at least 50 names the very first time you sit down. But what's going to happen is you're going to start thinking of more and more people. And if you're like, gosh, I just can't think of anybody. That's not true. Believe me, you can. But if you need to go through your phone, go through your emails and go through your Facebook friends. I can tell you that's a goal that I always have when I'm starting a new business. And I haven't even gotten probably a 10th through my phone yet or my Facebook friends. I, I've sent out a bunch of emails, but I haven't gone through all the names either. So there's a lot of people you can be reaching out to. So once you get that list of names, what is your reach out goal? What is it for you? When I first started, I was also juggling a few things and I needed to transition over to this business. So I was reaching out to five people a day. For you, maybe it's 10 people a day. For some of you, you might have a really big goal and you're going for 20 people a day. Whatever it is for you, write down that goal. I'm going to reach out to this many people a day. And how much time will you commit to that every single day? For some of you, you work full-time jobs. There's teachers on here, right? There's uh, Chrissy's on here and she runs a whole wedding planning business and she's very busy. So maybe she's going to say, you know what? I'm going to do 20 minutes before I leave my house in the morning. I'm going to do 20 minutes on my lunch break. And I'm going to do 20 minutes at night when I get home before I close down for the night. Whatever that is for you, if you have a commitment, you'll stick to it. If you're just floating around trying to decide when you're going to reach out to people and when you're going to follow up, it's probably not going to happen on a day where you get busy. And then your dreams are being pushed to the side. Don't allow that to happen to yourself. So commit right now. I My goal is this. And my second thing is I want to reach out to this many people per day with a simple message. And we'll talk about where you can find those messages if you're not sure what to say. Now, listen, everybody is different. Some of you, it comes very natural. You know exactly what you want to say when you reach out to somebody. Some of you need ideas and that's totally fine. So we have this amazing app called Boards. You'll get it on your app store on your phone and you can also use it on the computer. And once you join in, if you need this information, um, Christina, maybe you can put it in the chat for me since I know you're on here, um, the invite. But you want to make sure that you get familiar with this. Maybe spend 10 minutes a day or block 30 minutes on a Saturday morning and get to know your boards. There's so much great information here. But here's some reach out info right here. You can copy and paste some great ideas that you've that people have already done before you and be able to use those scripts from others, right? You can also see all kinds of great information in here. You know, for me, I know a lot of people will ask me questions and I want to have the scientific research to go back and share with them. So if you go under this folder, you'll see all kinds of stuff. And there's lots in here that you can use, okay? And again, with the reach out, you, this is an amazing video right here that we have right away with Honey Sigari, who's our CEO and founder. And it just kind of shares with people like what her vision was, why she started this company and where she's where she envisions it going. So this is always a great one as well to use when you're reaching out to people. All right, step three, crafting your message. What will you say? Right. So as you're reaching out to people, one of the best things to do is ask them questions. And again, you can get some great ideas on the board app, but ask them, hey, if you could change one thing about your body or your health in the next 30 days, what would that be? And then speak to that. Maybe they talk about they want to lose weight, but maybe for them, it's energy. Maybe like Sarah Doty this weekend for her, it was just getting even more healthy. She's already super healthy, but she's a high level executive. So for her, it's like, hey, I need to be really focused and I need to have energy and I need to have stamina. And so that's why NAD is helping her. Everybody is different. So if I went into the message and was only talking about weight loss, that's a somebody who I would have lost right away. She doesn't need to lose weight. Right. So making sure you know about them. And making sure you you kind of move your message based around the things that they're struggling with the most. And then also, if you have a story, you want to make sure you share your story. How have these products impacted and helped you? Okay. Let me just see really quick. It says there's people in the waiting room and I can't get back there, I don't think. There we go. All right. Awesome. We got two more people joining us. So that was step three. So going through your message, crafting your message, getting comfortable with your message, that's going to be something that you're going to have to do on your own, but you can use what other people are doing. You can check out what we have in the boards, 
but also listening to what that person wants, needs, and desires, and then sharing your own experience if you have one. If you don't have an experience yet on these products, it doesn't mean you can't share, right? I didn't have an experience with a lot of the products that I've already sold, uh, including uh, Samorlin, but I share with them other people's experience and what I've heard them say based on what they're telling me they want, okay? Step four, leverage social media. We have a complete 10-day plan on boards, you can get it on boards under social media, but we also have it in our Facebook group. And it's actually so important that you guys are in our Facebook group. I got bumped out. So hold on one second. And that one is called Team Joy. And when you go here, you can click on guides. If you're on the phone, you'll see three little lines like a hamburger. You can click there and find guides. But I'm on my computer. And right here, you'll see a 10-day launch plan. And in here, we give you literally what to post each day and get comfortable with it for 10 days. It's such a great opportunity for you to be able to go through that. It has polls, reels, educational stories. It gives you ideas about how to engage with your audience, curiosity posts. And so this is a great way. If you follow the 10-day plan, you're going to have great ideas. You're going to get great content out there and you're going to have people engaging with you and you're going to feel more comfortable, especially if you're somebody who's not used to using social media, maybe as often or even at all. This is a great plan for you to start getting active on your social media again and go through the 10-day. And here's the thing. Go through it yourself. You might tweak it a little bit. You might go, I don't really like that poll suggestion. I'm going to do a different one. <clears throat> and that's great. You make it your own. And then you can share with others when they join your team. Right? Because if you haven't gone through it yourself, it's very hard for you to share it with others. What else? Posting consistently. We know that keeping your audience engaged is how you're going to have the most success. <clears throat> I just came back from Cabo this weekend. And I met all kinds of people on this trip that have been with the company since it, since it launched in June. Some of them are already making $13,000 a month. One girl was making $20,000 a month. One girl making $8,000 a month. And when I asked them about their social media, not all of them are selling completely on social media. But I can tell you what they're all doing is showing up on social media. And I would say that's my platform too. If you look, watch my Facebook, my Instagram, you'll see I show up. And yes, I still reach out to people. Yes, I still connect to people. I send out emails. I connect to people. I talk to people in person. But my social media also uh, confirms what I'm also sharing with them and also attracts people to me. So you want to make sure that you're keeping your audience engaged. You want to share tips. Now, listen. In the boards, you're going to find all kinds of scientific information, all kinds of product information. On the website, you can literally go to your LEMD.com site and find underneath each product information that you can copy and paste and put into your stories or make a reel or make a post about. But you don't have to know it all. You don't have to be, you know, Mr. Molecule and know every little thing about the product but you want to educate people. And so one of the formulas that I love to personally do for a week is think like, what, what do I want to share this week? Well, this week I'm going to be sharing microdosing because we're launching microdosing for trisepatide and semaglutide. So I want to show people why, even if you don't need to lose weight, these two products are GLP ones and they will help to reduce inflammation. They will help your gut health. They will help with all different kinds of things, right? Like lowering cholesterol, blood sugar, uh, helps with cardio health. So this week, I'm going to be educating on that. I'm going to be interviewing somebody who is already microdosing and loving it. And by the way, get involved in the community. Get involved in our Team Joy face, uh, Facebook Messenger chat, because when you meet other people in our community, you can ask them like, hey, who in here has already been doing microdosing? Somebody will say me. And then you can say, can I interview you on Facebook Live or something or, inter or Instagram Live or something like that. And that's a great way to get information out. Um, I also, I'll share information. I'll share something funny, right, throughout the week. And so I'm connecting with them. I'm not just educating, but I'm also sharing something relatable, maybe somebody else's story or my own. But this is the kind of stuff you want to do and show up in your stories. Go look at what other people are doing. You only need to post once a day, but you can put three to five different things in your stories a day and let people be able to check it out that way. And guys, listen, the best copycat wins. So as you're watching other people on social media that are having success in this business, if you like something, take it, make it your own. Tweak it a little bit, change it a little bit, make it your own, okay? And feel comfortable doing that. 
Step five, convert your leads into customers, okay? So now you have you have somebody that you're starting to talk to. You want to make sure you share your website with them, lemd.com slash whatever your username is. Share testimonies of other people that they can relate to. Maybe you've seen some stories on um, LEMD's Instagram. They have a great Instagram. Join LEMD is the name of their Instagram. Maybe you've heard other people in our, in our chat or in our group, or maybe on Wednesday night when we do our 7 p.m. PM Eastern uh, meet the founder event. We always have three stories shared every single Wednesday night. Maybe you video clip a little bit of, of somebody's story and you get to share that, something that they can relate to. Then invite them to our Facebook community, which we'll talk about in a minute called Longevity and Wellness and ask them if they have any questions. This one is a part that I think a lot of people miss out on. They, they send them everything they're asking for and then they forget to ask a question. By simply saying, is there, or do you have any questions for me? Or is there anything that seemed um, confusing to you? Or another great question that I love to ask is, was there anything that I sent you that piqued your uh, excitement, that got you super interested, or that you're curious about? And then they'll let you know. And if they have any questions, put them in a three-way message with one of your leaders. Now, why would you do that? Because it's validation right? Um, if it's business, maybe you know there's one person that's one of your leaders that is really business driven. You want to put the person in that. Maybe there's somebody else that you know is very product driven. So it doesn't have to always be the exact same person. And what is a three-way message? Because there's people on here that have maybe never done that before. It's simply putting three people together on a text message or a Facebook messenger chat. So it, it could be something as simple as this. Hey, this is my friend Chrissy, and she's been on the product for about a month now. I would love for you to hear her experience of what she's been noticing, and feel free to ask us any questions, because I know you were saying that you are still a little bit nervous about trying these products because you've heard some bad stuff from people, but uh, you're getting excited about it now, and I just wanted you to hear somebody else's story, right? Or it could be something like, hey, I know you were asking me some questions, so I threw my friend Blair into this message with us because she's been on the products for over a year now, and I know she can answer any questions that you have. Okay, something just simple like that. Uh, we were just talking about the Facebook group, right? So it's so important that you guys get engaged in the Facebook group. Here, let me get to, this is what we call a customer group. If you're not familiar with that, this is the one, the Longevity and Wellness Collective. So this is for potential customers, current customers. It's for anybody who just wants to be a fly on the wall and learn more. Whenever I add somebody that's starting their GLP-1 journey, for example, I will click this post that's featured with our really amazing guide, if you guys haven't got through that yet from corporate, and I'll tag them. And I'll just say, hey, this is a great resource. Or sometimes a new uh, friend of mine will you know, be part of the group. And let's see if I can find one of these. Like right here. She, and I'll just say like, hey, she's starting. Sometimes I'll say, what should you, what should she expect? And people will share. And that's what's so great about this community. But there is something really important that you want to know. You want to ask people before you invite them into this group. Hey, we have a really great community where we're here to support other people who are going through this journey. I'd love to add you so you can be a fly in the wall and learn a little bit more. Can I add you to the group? Then you add them to the group. Then you tag them in a pinned post, and then I always message them with the link to the group so that they know where to find it, and also so that they can answer those questions. There's a couple questions they have to answer in order to get in the group, so you want to make sure they know where to find the group so that they can answer those questions and get entered into the group. All right, and this is really valuable because it allows them to be part of the community. And then step six, add in business conversations. A lot of you guys are running with the products first, which is something I generally do a lot too, but you don't want to overthink the business conversation. You want to share it with them. All right. You want to make sure that you ask them about, hey, are you interested in learning more about the business opportunity that's attached to this as well? You can earn 20 to 40% commissions off of the products that you sell and earn commissions off of what your team does. And then invite them to our Wednesday night Zoom. This is an opportunity opportunity where you guys could be inviting all week. This is my follow-up all the time. If people don't answer me or the conversation goes kind of dead, my follow-up is always inviting on Wednesday. It's like, hey, I know we were talking last week. I just wanted to circle back around and invite you to the founder, meet the founder on Wednesday night at 7 p.m. Eastern. It's a great opportunity to hear straight from our CEO and be able to learn a little bit about what's happening with this business and about our products. And you're going to hear from three people sharing their story. 
And then we also give a little bit of information at the end about how you can be a customer or join the business. So it's a great way to circle back around, but also it's a great thing to invite people to. And so that's a, a really important part. Now, when you're inviting people to learn more about the business and they're really interested and you're new and you don't feel comfortable, this is again, another really great time to put them in the three-way chat, okay? Because this is a great way for them to learn, you to learn from somebody else. I always say, the best way that I learn is by listening to others. I just listen to a conversation over and over again or listen to a podcast over and over again, and then I've got it memorized. So putting people in a chat with your leader and hearing how they share the business is only going to help you learn how to share the business and get more comfortable with doing it yourself. And then know your products. Listen, we have some amazing products. You want to find your hero product. What do we mean by that? The product that you're going to use. Is it going to be a GLP-1? Is it going to be NAD? Is it going to be um, our human growth hormone with Samoralin? Is it going to be synapsin? Is it going to be sexual health with PT-141? Find that product and get started on it so you have your own story. But you also want to understand what the other products are. So understand what we have available in the longevity category. What do we have in the sexual health category? What do we have in the weight management category? All right. And then a really easy thing to do is start to utilize your chat GPT. If you don't have the free version of chat GPT, you, you want to get it, I promise. So I'll go on there and I've now taught my chat GPT my voice and my ideal client. So I tell it, hey, I'm looking for women who are between the ages of 40 and 55. They're driven, they're successful, but they are hitting perimenopause or menopause and they are feeling exhausted. They're gaining weight, their body aches, blah, 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 blah. And I go through all the things, right? Now ChatGPT knows who I'm looking for. And then I say, hey, give me some information about why GLP-1 would be so helpful for a woman in menopause who's feeling frustrated with her body right now. And literally it will give me ideas. Now I can use everything that it just gave me to make a reel, to make a post, to use in my stories, to use it for an email, so much of the information that I get, I can use in so many different places. And so this also helps me learn. And so I also want to challenge you guys, go into the boards app and go into that science, scientific information and listen to a podcast, listen to one a week. And you'll gain so much. Sometimes for me, it's only 10 minutes a day I can listen to that podcast. It's when I popped in the car and when I got out of the car. And for me, I, I do most of my stuff in, in like a 20 minutes uh, radius of my house. So I might only get to listen for 10 or 20 minutes that day. But at least I'm filling my brain with information about these products and learning more. And that helps me to be valuable to everybody. Now, let's get to the exciting stuff. How do you make the money, right? Like we're all here to help and change the world and help people feel their best and be their best, but we want to be rewarded for that as you should. And so one of the important things is understanding that there are bonuses that you can actually earn in your first two months. Now, here's the thing. If you signed up today, October 21st, it, it isn't two months from October 21st. It's two calendar months. So you would only have until the end of November to earn these bonuses. So you want to get going right away. The first bonus is the third spot of the company, and you earn a $100 bonus, one-time bonus, for lead brand partner. You guys, that's only bringing in $1,200 worth of volume, which means it can come from your team, not just you, and $300 in personal volume. So 300 of that $1,200 that your team is creating needs to come from your own personal volume. That can be your own purchase or your customer, okay? That is so achievable. That's like three or four people ordering GLP-1, okay? The second bonus is the four spot of the company. It gets you to senior brand partner and you get a $200 one-time bonus on top of your commissions. I wanna make sure I say that. We're gonna go over commissions in a second. This is on top of commissions. Third bonus is the fifth spot. Team manager, you get a $300. Fourth bonus, sixth spot. Advanced manager, $400 bonus. Fifth spot is the seventh spot of the company. Senior manager, $500. Now listen, if you add all of that up, it's $1,500 in bonuses that you can hit in that first two months. If you earn it after the first two months, you can earn it in the first six months. So you have four more months to earn it, but you're only going to get 50% of whatever that number is. So you wanna go for that right away. I was able to achieve this $1,500 in bonuses in the month of, uh, of August and got paid on it in September. That was a nice little $1,500 extra money, right? In my lap for going for it. So let's also like talk a little bit about the comp plan. Now, when you go into your back office in the training portal, there are videos on the comp plan. I highly suggest you going through it yourself so that you can familiarize yourself with it and so that you get more comfortable. This right here shows you, remember a minute ago, I was just talking about how you can earn these different bonuses. They're all right here. 
You can see exactly what you need to do to achieve that. You can see exactly how much commission you're going to make. And you want to get as fast as possible to this uh, advanced, uh, I'm sorry, you want to get right here to senior manager as fast as possible so that you become a founding member. But even more exciting is if you can hit director by December 31st, you will get to actually be invited to Honey Sagari, our CEO's house in California in February for a special director retreat. And I know all of you guys can achieve that. All right, so how do you make the money? Well, you earn commissions off of your sales. So you can earn anywhere from 20 to 40% on all of your personal volume from customers, including your own order. So you can see right here, let's see if you brought in zero to you know, $349, you're going to earn 20%. But if you hit $350 in personal volume or more, you're going to get 25%, 800 or more, 30%, and so on. So the goal is to get to this 5,000 points so that you're earning 40% commission. And like I was talking about that Founders Club, the LEMD Founders Club is an elite community to qualify for Founders Club. A brand partner must attain the senior manager rank or above within their initial six months and you will be considered Founders Club, and it has to be done before the 31st of December, and you will be considered a founding member of LEMD. That's how new we are. It's so exciting. All right, so I'm going to actually stop sharing, and I know I ran through all of that really quickly, and some of you are probably like, I want more information on the, the compensation plan, but here's what I'm going to tell you to do. Go to the training portal at partner.lemd.com, log in, get into the training portal and go through the compensation plan videos. Once you've done that and you've educated yourself and you understand it a little bit more, reach out to your leaders if you have any questions because we want to make sure we are helpful and explain and are detailed with you. But I'll tell you right now, focusing on understanding the compensation plan before you even start to ignite your business and start getting out there and sharing with people and talking to people is only gonna slow you down, right? Because a confused mind does nothing. So you wanna get focused. What do you want out of this business? How are you going to go after it? And how quickly are you going to do it? I can tell you there are people on here right now, like Chrissy, who I talked to today, and she signed up and she's like, I'm getting three people on that Zoom tonight, right? Uh, there's people on here like uh, Talia. Uh, I don't know if Talia's on here right now, actually, but Talia is a great example. She was like, she's a physical therapist. She's never done anything like this before. And she's already gotten five customers because she's like, I'm just going to reach out to five or 10 people every single day on my way to work. I'm just going to reach out to them and share and then follow up with them after work. And she's already having success. Um, there's people on here like Lucy Pinto, who was getting her eyebrows done on Friday and shared with her eyebrow or with her brow specialist, right? So think outside the box. Also think about not just your friends friends and people that you know, you know how we went through all those different names. But I also want to give you a hint. This does work for business to business as well. So what do I mean by that? Who do you know that owns their own chiropractic business? A lot of times chiropractors, they don't want to have to bring in another medical staff in order to, to sell the peptides out of their office. And they don't want to have to have the inventory. So this is a great opportunity for them to share longevity and health and wellness with people and be able to just give them a link. Also thinking about who do you know that owns their own business, maybe a skincare business, or they own their own brow business, like I was just sharing, or like Chrissy, who's on her owns her own wedding planning business. These are such amazing business that don't really want to have to hire a medical staff to have to, you have to have, you know, a doctor or somebody medical to be able to prescribe these to people. So instead they just use this link and they share it with people. And so it provides an amazing opportunity for them to be part of this peptide world that believe me, they're hearing about and they know about, and this is a way that they can share with others as well. So uh, I'm going to let you guys, if anybody has any questions, you guys can unmute or feel free to ask in the chat because now that we're not sharing screen, I can see the chat again. Oh, yes. Liz Wilkerson's using Synapse, and I'm so excited. She's going to share not this week, but next week with us. Oh, Mandy, I love that. Mandy said that uh, she was a top leader in a gut health MLM company for eight years, also owned an IV hydration spa. Those are great ones to go to. Left both this year to pursue multiple incomes and peace and time freedom. Yeah, I love that. All right. I don't see any questions in the chat. If anybody wants to unmute, I'll wait another a minute so you guys can unmute and see if anybody has any questions for me. All right. Awesome. Well, 
Get back with your leader if they weren't on here tonight and just say, hey, I have done that getting started. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them. I am Blair Critch on Facebook. You are always welcome to ask me any questions. We also have our chat, which is uh, Team Joy Connect. We'd love for you to be on that messenger chat on Facebook because it's a great place where you can go and ask people questions um, as well, but also be part of the community and uh, see what other people are doing. And again, anything you see on my social media, you're welcome to copy and repeat. Just maybe change it up a little bit because Instagram and Facebook don't like it when we just copy and paste, but you are welcome to take anything that I do and make it your own. And Cindy just said, I shared with my chiropractor and I'm meeting with him this week to discuss. Awesome, Cindy. I'll give you one little hint, okay? One tip that I'll give you um, is once your, which I have no doubt your chiropractor will probably be like, oh, this is very interesting. Like, tell me more. Let's let's talk about this. If they're interested and they say yes, sometimes um, one of my friends who's a chiropractor, she's like, I probably wouldn't sign up, but I'd let my office manager sign up. And then I asked if we could do a longevity uh, event together. So what we're talking about possibly doing is they're inviting everybody that's part of their practice. I'm inviting my email list and my Facebook and, you know, shouting it out all over my social media. And we're going to invite everybody to a uh, longevity event at this chiropractic office locally to me. And then the goal is, is that I'm going to get there an hour before she closes down at night so that I can talk to the people that are already there with my table that's set up. And then we're going to have the event after they close down and hopefully her clients come in, some of my friends and people I know in the community come in. So I'm benefiting her. She's getting new people coming into her space that she she would have never met before, and I'm benefiting as well. Um, Liz said, our chiropractor owns his own practice and sells other health supplements. How should I approach him? Yeah, I would go in if you already use him and you're spending money with him. I, when you go in there next, I would be bold and say, hey, listen, I've actually partnered with a telehealth concierge company that's focused on on preventative health with longevity, sexual health, and weight management, and soon to come hormone replacement. This would be a great opportunity for us to partner together and be able to share longevity with the people in our community. Is that something you're open to? And I would start with the event, right? Start with the event, Liz, because first of all, it's going to get you people that you would have never seen. And if he says, he or she says yes to the event, then at the event, they can see all the excitement and people that are coming around your table and they want to learn more. And both of you do a little spiel, like the chiropractor talks about how uh, chiropractic health helps with longevity and preventative health. You talk about the peptides. And then when they see the excitement, then you talk to them about, hey, do you want to sign up as a brand partner and put these people underneath you? Or do you want me to just take them myself? Um, what about health and wellness spas that already do semaglutide? Would there still be a, still be a potential? Yes, possibly. So we've had a couple people say that some some med spas have said no. Some have been like, oh, I'm actually interested because I don't have an access to trisepatide. We have access to trisepatide, and some people prefer that. Um, we also had one um, health spa say, yeah, I actually do not want to have to have a medical person on staff anymore. So I would prefer to be able to just put up a little display and tell them to go to my site and that's it. So everybody's going to be a little bit different. It depends on how they run their spa and, and how they want to do stuff like that. Yes, gyms are such a great idea, Cindy, because you guys listen, who think about who's hurting since COVID. Unfortunately, a lot of gyms are really hurting since COVID. So adding on another stream of income is so valuable to them. And if you look at some of the top trainers on social media, I don't know if you guys follow any trainers on TikTok, Instagram, but I do. And I actually love at home workouts. I'm like one of those people. Um, I love to work out in my backyard and just sweat it out instead of being inside of a gym. And so I'll follow a lot of these people and their ideas. And a lot of them are sharing microdosing of GLP-1s right now and also GLP-1s. So that is totally somebody who I would go to the gyms. Absolutely. It's on my list of things to do. I have not gotten to yet. So it's, I think very important and a great idea. Oh, Liz, that's awesome. I love that. Yeah. And Liz actually brought up a great point too in the chat. She said, I met a new gym owner from a chamber of commerce. I'm visiting him in person this week to talk to him. Um, get into, if you have time and you can, man, get into these networking events. Even if you just said, I'm going to do one night a month, right? Or one luncheon a month. I mean, wow. There's so much value in meeting other people in your community who are also building businesses. And it's like, I'll scratch your back, you scratch mine. And you end up meeting some really cool people that you end up getting exposed to amazing networks. Yep. Happy hours are the best in those. I agree. They're awesome. 
All right, guys. Well, it doesn't seem like anybody has any questions. So we are going to close this up tonight. Thanks so much for joining us. Don't forget Wednesday night, 7 p.m. Eastern. If you can be on the Meet the Founder, invite, invite, invite. And here's a tip. I can't be on this Wednesday. Gary Simmons is leading. So if you have men, it's always nice for men to hear from other men. And Gary is awesome at that. And at the end, he always goes through the compensation plan with people, a quick one. So I would definitely invite, invite, invite. And here's the thing. Even if you can't be on, I can't be on Wednesday. I'm still inviting. Nobody's going to steal my people. You don't have to worry about that with this team. We are here to love on and help. And, and we want to see everyone succeed because a win for one is a win for all. When somebody on this team starts making $25,000 a month, that means that other people know they can make $25,000 a month, right? When one person on this team hits executive director, it means everybody has a chance to hit there. So it's amazing. And uh, I appreciate you guys being on here tonight. And thank you, Stephanie. That was a very sweet compliment. I appreciate it. Good night, guys. Thank you. Thank you.